The trust was started in 1584 by a, a Faversham, rich Faversham merchant called Thomas Strangham, who left money and uh, properties to St Dunstan's Parish to be used to help the needy of the parish. The criteria is that they have to be resident in St Dunstan's Parish or ordinarily resident in St Dunstan's Parish, so that means that um, students who are going away to different towns to study can have help from us, but students who come into Canterbury to study can't have help from us. Um, and the only real strict, strict criteria is whether you're a, a St Dunstan's parishioner. Every year we do give we do give grants out. We make we do make awards. Last year we made about thirty thousand pounds worth of awards to about one hundred and ninety different either individuals or organisations. So we do do it, but we can never sit on our laurels and just just know that more applications are coming in. We constantly need to raise awareness of ourselves because because we're small, even though we've been around for such a long time. We're small. People come and go out of the parish, so it's always. There's always that impetus behind us to keep keep the awareness up. Anyone is eligible. You don't have to be phoning up because you've got a choice between new school uniform or food on the table that night. It's it's we would help somebody like that, but we we help people for all sorts of reasons. And in the current economic climate, everyone is finding it more difficult. Whether it's fuel bills or food prices or you know all the cost of living, petrol, and everybody. Everybody from time to time thinks, oh my goodness, something's hit their, their doorstep, how am I going to deal with this? It's, it's grants for normal people, It's obviously we want to reach the people who could most do with it, and those, those people who could most do with it generally would be those who are, who are really, really poor, but it's really, really not restricted to the, the poorest members. It's about helping everyone and providing a little safety net for those times when you think, what am I going to do?